I need to tie the area with a bit of cream and some uh, lidocaine just injected gently with a Botox needle under the, the lesion. I'm just going to use some gentle laser. Vibrated. Just protect the eye. Do you feel that at all? No. Sorry. I can feel that a little bit. Mm. We'll just work our way over on the lesion. Slowly. Removing all these fat cells. The beauty about the local anaesthetic is it just creates a little bit of a cushion between the lesion and the deeper tissues. We'll just turn the power down a little bit as we get to the, the base of the lesion. I'm using a saline soaked wipe, we just gently brush the tissues. It just creates a bit of contrast so you can work out <clears throat> which is lingering xanthalasma and which is actually healthy sort of subepithelial tissue. Not always that easy to tell the difference because you'd say after moistening the tissues a little bit you get a sense of whether there's still work to be done. I'm desperately keen to avoid going too deep. And we haven't done so here, but you can use adrenaline in your local anaesthetic mix. And the advantage of that is that uh, minimizes any bleeding or bruising you might get. But the laser is quite a nice system because it cauterizes as it goes, so bleeding is rarely an issue. If you have a patient with a tendency for bruising or bleeding, then yeah, use some adrenaline in your local anesthetic by all means. Recently, the lesion off extends a little bit further under the skin than is evident from the surface. But it heals so quickly and so forgivingly that definitely worth extending your margins just a little bit. Get the sense now that we're right at the bottom of this.
I think this is about as far as we dare take it. Even though there might be some residual strands of yellow tissue, that's not necessarily xanthalasma tissue. But either way, it's taken a great deal of laser energy, so its viability is debatable. But if we start going any further, we, we, you know, the bulk of what you see there is perfectly healthy underlying tissue that we don't want to violate. But sometimes you just can't help yourself. Okay.